good luck, I guess. I don't know. First time in Colorado, so we're hunting a ranch for wildlife place, which is kind of cool. It's a program that the state and private ranchers work together for the benefit of wildlife, give so many tags back to the state, uh, so on and so forth. So, it's a small piece of property, um, very few hunters, which I'm excited about. Craig, there's a few things happening in Craig. Cattle, coal, and hunt. So we're gonna head out and scout out this lower piece that we're gonna be hunting and see kind of what we're dealing with. Uh, this isn't a backcountry hunt. This isn't. That's kind of nice. We'll be driving to and fro in vehicles. That's something I'm not really used to, but it's cool. Out here to the lower piece, we're just gonna zero the gun. The gun's already zeroed, but we're just gonna verify. So, your dog feels good about it. So, should be cool. Always make sure buddies feel good. First evening here at Murphy's Ranch. We came up to his higher ranch and just to see if the see any deer, tons of elk, thousands of elk. I mean, elk hunter's paradise up here, but Murphy scouted a buck in here a little earlier and we we're just trying to see if he's still in here. He may have moved off. So just trying to see if we had a play up here on this upper ranch. Now we're gonna try to hunt the lower ranch probably tomorrow, but good day. Lots of elk, lots of fun. So this place is sweet. Spot these 
buck about 1,500 yards away. They're kind of going their rounds. Pretty nice bucks, two pretty nice bucks, but I still think this one we passed on earlier is bigger. We might need to go back and kill that buck. Just a real nice buck. It just didn't have brow tines. It just wasn't quite heavy enough, but. fell down the stairs, so I might need to get home as soon as I can. It might make sense just to go kill that block, but he's a nice block. You guys on? <laughs> 600 yards. 8.8 MOA. He's, he's a sick buck. He's got in lines. Seven mag, Hornady ELDX. I'm still shaking, dude. I'm, hit it smart.
One of the things that's really fortunate about being in this Ranch for Wildlife program is how we get to manage the hunts, you know. I mean, we get to find out our tags and sell them at a year advance and really get to manage everything a lot better than if we had to work on a draw system. <laughs> it's awesome. My little four year old. Better call her back. This is why we do it right here tenderloin, backstrap, venison. Doesn't get any better than that right here. <laughs>